Hey guys, this is Cindy Marie. Welcome to my channel, especially if you are new. I appreciate you stopping by. Um, what is this, guys? This is fall stuff at Hobby Lobby. I went to go look for clearance on 4th of July stuff. And I mean, I guess I should have known they'd had fall stuff out. But like, I was just pleasantly surprised because, you know, I don't know. Summer's in full swing here, but... I really did enjoy going through these aisles. I'm not going to lie. Um, I don't think I'm going to be purchasing much because I have quite a bit. But, you know, never say never. Um, I also am filming this. Obviously, after I did all my shopping, I'm um, going back and doing, you know, obviously a voiceover here. And I went to Meyer. That was the last store that I shopped at for my creamers that, you know, stuff like that, that I was missing from my other hauls. And I went to the women's section, just looking. There was a dress that I liked and they don't have any more. It was this really purple, pretty dress. They had it actually in my size. But anyways, wasn't there. But I did notice that they had all fall colors in the women's section, like just orange and brown and green. It was just, it was so weird. Like, like, hello, fall's here or not yet, but you know, and for some reason, seeing things this early makes me want to buy it because I'm just afraid it's not going to be there. Like, not really from like, high, I mean, I'm not worried about like fall. I'm talking about like clothes and stuff because, you know, I like to get a few pieces of, you know, orangey green I like fall colors um and it just it just makes me happy especially yellows and now I'm like well I'm gonna maybe have to go back because what if they don't have my size because other people are thinking the same as me so anyways these vases were so pretty vases not vases whatever I said um they had some really cute things look at these dog towels oh there's no Bernie's Mountain though so I wouldn't get it but they really had some pretty stuff. I was just amazed. I remember last year when I did this tour for, you know, my YouTube channel. Jeez, it seems crazy long ago because like I think it's going to come up to my year anniversary soon for YouTube. But anyways, um, and I remember like how many aisles of fall stuff they had. This little pic caught my eye. How cute. But it goes on. And yeah, so I was just amazed that there were so many. Um, I did skip over some of the aisles, like the garland and just that kind of stuff. Um, I always notice how many pumpkins they have, like so many different pumpkins. Um, I always like these things to the left. Well, that was a cute banner. I really wanted to get that, but I, I passed. Um, but they had really cute, like garland things. Um, not really sure what you call them. The football stuff is cute, but we just don't watch football anymore. But if you do, this is cute stuff. And all this stuff is already 40% off. I think I love these signs. I love the blue pumpkins. I really like that one. And that one. What a cute Highland cow. Um, if I turn to the right here. Yeah, I think I have that already. I went and I actually did get some 4th of July stuff. Yeah, um, you'll see it in a little bit in my haul, but um, I already had the same 4th of July sign and I bought it last year. So that was kind of funny. I knew when I picked that up that it felt familiar. Um, this is Christmas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I just, I passed over that. I'm like, nope, can't do it. Can't do it. And they had more Christmas stuff and it, it, it it's pretty, not gonna lie. Um, yep, more pumpkins. I love these pumpkins. I thought this was cute. Love you more than pumpkin anything. So cute. But yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed myself. So anyways, um, I'm sorry I talked through the whole thing. But um, yeah, stop by at your Hobby Lobby and get some fall stuff. Here's my Target haul. I got this cute soft romper for Kayla. It was $14. And I think it was a medium. Yeah, it's a medium. She needed some more sports bras. And I got this black top for me. I like how it has this little cutout 
on the front and it's actually like a wire so it shouldn't flop down or anything and that was $18 I did spend $118.54 not very much actually I got some Ooh, let me turn Okay, sorry, I had to turn the light on. I got a bag of romaine lettuce, one Kramer in case Walmart doesn't have any, but I did put my order through and there's already only four left, so we will see if I get some. I got Connor, one prime. This is his favorite flavor, the lemon lime. I got some ketchup and mayo for our upcoming barbecue next weekend. I got Connor, more of his melatonin. I got a more expensive brand of dry shampoo. It's by Kristen S. I'm hoping that this is better. I like have bought so many brands. Um, Connor wanted conditioner, so I got him the conditioner to the shampoo that he has. This stuff is so expensive. He better use like a dime size. Um, I saw this cute thing in the dollar spot at Target. It's just like, what is it, macrame? Um, I don't know what, what you call it, like the fabric, but it also has like a Bernie's mountain dog in the picture, but I want to um, put like current photos in it somewhere in my living room or somewhere in my main I did go to Hobby Lobby just to kind of check things out, and I did get two fall items. Um, I got this spoon rest. I thought it was super cute. It was 40% off for the fall stuff, and I got these mushrooms. And this sign right here was 66% off, so I think it ended up being... Um... I want to say it was $4.42 and it was $13 originally and oh yeah and then I also got this cute sign as well for like little wooden ladders like how cute are those um I don't know I think those were $4.19 no I lied $2.38 I think yeah anyways we are having a Hawaiian barbecue next Saturday. So I got a couple of um, banners. These are only $2 each. I already have stuff because we've had Hawaiian um, parties before. And so and I got this cute little centerpiece for a table. So I did not spend much. I spent $20.93. And then I did go to a, um, it's a plus size thrift store. Or yeah, thrift store. I guess you call it. Yeah, I think it's a thrift store. Um, I got these cute soft star shorts and I found a Hawaiian ish like these kind of flowers to go with you know for something for me to wear um, that's kind of like gaudy <laughs> so I got that and I think I spent like oh and I got these earrings I thought those were cute um, I don't know where my receipt is but I think I spent like 15 so um, my husband is out of town. We did have some, um, we are having some rent-a-car issues. Um, we failed to realize that we needed to have a credit card, um, to, I, I paid for his car, but I guess you need a credit card to put a deposit down. So, yeah. So I'm going to try to get a refund on the rent-a-car. He ended up getting one through his work. Unfortunately, but we're gonna have to pay that once his trip is done. So that is my day so far. So not good. Um, I had like no sleep, and so yeah, I just been dealing with you know a little bit of stresses, and it's really hard when your husband is two thousand miles away. So a little frustrated, but we're gonna make the best of it. He at least hopefully can get a car, and that's all taken care of, and we'll figure out the rest one thing at a time. Um, stay tuned for my Walmart pickup. I am going to be doing that later on 
this evening. It's actually at eight o'clock. I tried to push it out as far as I could. Um, I ended up not being able to sleep before taking my husband to the bus station. And then when I did get home, I got involved in this series that I was watching on Netflix. And I just had to finish it. Um, it's a Spanish series. What was it called? Lady Voyeur or something like that. It ended up being really good. Um, but yeah, I didn't go back to sleep till like nine-ish or maybe 10. And then I didn't get going until like one. So it's been a very later afternoon for me, but it's okay. I'm here. We got it done. Um, I should have went to Aldi, decided to pass on that for right now. I don't need much. And then I just got me and the kids some beef for real. So I'm going to go, I think, try to take a nap for a little bit or lay down. And you'll see my hauls in a little bit. Sorry, it's so dark. Talk to you guys later. I am finally home after a two hour delay of groceries. Um, last time when they did this, they said that it wasn't delayed. They don't know why it said that. So I'm like, well, I'm just going to drive down and I'm just going to go see, you know, what's going on. No, they really were delayed this time. So I apologize for my appearance. I am greasy looking. I'm tired. Um, I just want to take a shower and relax. It's been a long day. But anyways, here is my haul. I don't know how much it costs at this moment. Um, everything was available. They substituted a couple things that I kind of like, like what? But we'll, we'll figure it out. Okay, over here is stuff for the barbecue. So I could have sworn that I got another bag of chips. Maybe, maybe I did it. So I got these chips for the barbecue. I got great value, wavy, couple bottles of pop. Okay, they didn't have regular Mountain Dew. Okay, so I'm missing a regular Mountain Dew bottle. Um, so I got a and Zero Sugar, Diet Mountain Dew, and Sprite Zero, Bush's Baked Beans. I got some um, Cherry Gummies and Sour Patch Kids. So for Girl Scouts, we are doing this. July is National Ice Cream Month. She needs to get 15 points in order to get the patch. So these are the things that we're doing. Well, she's kind of like a child who doesn't really like to change and, and try things, but we're going to try. So we got strawberry ice cream. Um, if anything, she doesn't like it. I like it. Um, it's good, you know. I got a half gallon of chocolate milk, a gallon of Regular 2%, shredded Parmesan, a smaller box of Smuckers since he's out of town right now. So this is where I wanted one of these and I got these. And I know that if I put down, if these are not what I wanted, like if they don't have the Ham American, that I don't want them. So I'm hoping she at least will try it. Um, I did get a thing of fruit barrels, tropical for the barbecue as well. We got a big package, of, well not big package, but a package of Viva paper towels. I asked for hickory smoked regular and they gave us thick. So that is fine. We're going to try orange sherbet tubes. She said she's had the regular like sherbet before, but in a tube, it's like so much more fun. I mean, so, oh, okay. So they didn't have my creamer. So I'm glad I got one today, at least from, um, target, but I did get Zach's creamer. Um, she wanted fudge bars. So this is, she's going to get a point for this one because it's ice cream on a stick. This one is trying sherbet. So yeah, um, a huge thing of Aspen wood shavings for the guinea pig. This should last me close to a year because I just ran out. Um, guinea pig food. He got his Timothy hay back there. Kayla requested scoops and Connor likes these pretzels. I got cinnamon checks for the husband. Nature Valley chocolate chip muffin bars for me. I was out of the junk list peanut butter granola bar, so I got those. Lance crackers for Connor. Um, I usually make some kind of like sugar-free drink mix. Is this yeah? And so I'm gonna make this for the barbecue. So actually, I could put it by the barbecue stuff because I'm gonna put that stuff separately. I did get candy. My son actually doesn't want candy anymore, so he said he's not gonna eat this. So. Um, either I'll keep it for the barbecue or I don't know, but I did get candy for us. I got two packages of the, of Kayla's, uh, Pillsbury chocolate chip cookies that she likes, two Pringles, two cartons of eggs. We do still have like two left, but Connor's been eating them a lot. I wanted this for ice cream. I used to love this stuff as a kid. 
like tell me did you guys like this too i loved it the other chocolate syrup for kayla because she does make chocolate milk with this and put it on her ice cream so it goes fast bow tie pasta penne pasta i actually didn't need the penne um wonton strips got some stomach relief for kayla total bowl cleaner comet with bleach and lemon this is not what i wanted i wanted just lemon they gave me lemon verena Ugh. that's okay um this is the dish soap it's not like my favorite but i do like it so my total my total for walmart ended up being 199.55 so they were out of two or three creamers i'm not sure which i put on there they were out of the mountain dew and i also wanted a cheesecake pie they're always out they get like a couple of them. And I was seeing it throughout the day. They were telling me like, this may be low. You might want to substitute it. And of course, I didn't want it substituted. Just like I didn't want the Lunchables substituted. Um, kind of frustrated about that. Like I literally said, don't replace it. Anyways, this is how my day's been going, guys. So thank you so much for watching. I am going to go to Sam's Club tomorrow. I have a big haul tomorrow. Um, you'll see. So I'm going to put all this away, chill, take a shower, have some coffee, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Well, hello, guys. It is Friday today. It is, I think it was like 82. It's really hot. I think it's humid. Um, we had lunch together. We went to Sam's Club and got dog food. So I'm going to show you what I got at Sam's Club. I spent $222.48. Okay, Connor decided he wanted original Rice Krispies. I got two things of bounce. Well, it comes with two. I got two pack of ibuprofen. Thought that would is just smarter, lasts us longer. Um, strawberries, these were pretty good looking, I would say. Um, these were $3.93 for two pounds a pretty good price i got a big thing of plates again we were completely out i got a package of brownies these angus beef patties are for our barbecue got zach his licorice i got a bag of doritos for the barbecue two loaves of the italian bread four pack of the glade spray and so I got two packages of hot dog buns and a package of hamburger buns. I think I'm going to freeze these just because the barbecue is not until the 15th, just in case. Big thing of toilet paper. We did get um, sports drinks and a case of water. A pack of 18 brats needs to go in the freezer. Um, I got some chicken breasts. I need to separate those. And I got four sirloin steaks. Yeah. And then we got two packages of beef hot dogs for the barbecue. And like I said, we got dog food. What else did we do? I think that was it. Yeah. Yeah. So Kayla has a sleepover tonight. So I wanted to make sure that we were home to get that all ready. Um, plus, I need to budget and pay some bills. So anyways, I hope that you enjoyed all of my hauls. Um, I have to figure out my total, which I'll probably pop right here. And that uh, I didn't really have a budget, but because um, I knew with the barbecue and stuff, it wasn't going to be cheap. Um, I still need more stuff. Zach has to go to Woodman's once he gets back from California. Um, his budget's usually around 160 um, but yeah, I don't have my creamers and stuff like that. So I still need a few more things. Plus I need to get veggies and fruit for the barbecue. So yeah, need to get more things. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this haul. Have a great weekend and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.